Hi everyone! In this particular example, we will now look at how a coffee cup calorimeter affects your decision on how to determine the value of Q. So pretty much the same question. A certain reaction is run using a, now this time we're going to say, coffee cup calorimeter. The value of delta E was found to be 10 kilojoules, and the value of delta H was found to be 8 kilojoules. Determine Q. So now in this question, you're tasked with, what does coffee cup calorimeter signify? Hopefully you remember that that means that there is no change in pressure. In that circumstance, you need to know the relationship that delta H is equal to Q at constant pressure. Based on the question then, that means that Q would have to be equal to 8 kilojoules.